hey you guys it's your girl jacayla a and i'm back with another video today i'm going to get into some vlogging i'm actually actually driving right now i usually don't come on this platform and show my face i'm usually just all about the nails and the hauls and you know tutorials and stuff like that but i'm about to go to hobby lobby it's very gloomy and it's just very i don't know it doesn't look good outside where i am right now where i live it's like raining and so i'm about to just go try to uplift my own spirits and buy me some stuff people cannot drive people cannot drive i'm gonna go and just do something to make myself feel a little happier and a little bit more in a better mood so i'm going to go to hobby lobby for no specific reason just because i feel like it and we're gonna go see like what they have in there as far as nail stuff i need some containers i want to go look at the Swarovski crystals just to see what it looks like i know they're at michael's but i did not know they were at hobby lobby so i'm excited to go and see about what that is giving and i also really want some soft pastels because i really like to see those videos on instagram when people use the soft pastels and white or clear acrylic and they like you know make a colored acrylic like i always use um powders that i can buy off of amazon but i never did it the soft pastels way so i want to try that because that's just like a huge money saver a huge money saver instead of going to look for the certain type of powders that i want if i could make them and then mix them and, and, and do my own thing baby so i'm gonna go try to find that and i'm gonna get some footage in the store if i can i'm gonna try to be real sneaky in the store and get some footage i don't think they're gonna mind um and we'll see and i'll check back in when i get there all right y'all we are here let's go on in and see what they got A pink tree. A pink tree will be everything. Look at all the stuff for a pink tree. So pretty. So, 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 so pretty. OMG. A pink tree will be so cute. So, I'm already obsessed with this store. I love it so much. This pink hat box. so big and it's only ten dollars it's so cute oh, i have nothing to go with this yeah. all the pink stuff for baking i would i love a pink aesthetic like love a pink aesthetic it's my favorite color Okay,
Friday. Yes, this is the flat back combo pack. But I'm seeing most of these are for clothing. Not really for what I want for, but hold on. These are pretty. These big pieces are really pretty. See, this is why some of them cost so much money to get for nail nails. These two big pieces are $20. This one big piece is six dollars. These are really pretty, really, really pretty. Oh, those are gorgeous. And so are these. y'all so that was basically hobby lobby in a nutshell this is my first vlog i enjoyed it i'm gonna do more i want to do michael's i want to do my nail supply store i want to do um a bunch of uh, different stuff but this is the hobby Lobby, and i want to come back here but this is hobby lobby my first time coming i actually saw my cousin in there y'all and she was gonna give me a 15 percent discount but by the time i was checking out i couldn't find her so i ended up spending 56 dollars and 83 cents I don't think that's bad for everything that I got because I will make it, use of it and it will make me much more money than $50. So I just went ahead and, you know, bought it. But, yeah, that discount would have been right on time. That's why I know I'm going to come back because I'm going to get that discount, baby. It's so dark right now, too. Um, It's only 6. My clock is fast. It's like 6.40 something where I am right now, where I live. So, you know, in the winter, it get more dark. So the first thing I got are these pastels. This is one of the major things that I wanted to come get. I hate this lighting right now. But these are the soft pastels, the premium ones. This was $20 for 24 of them. They had one that was $30 for 36 of them. I think that's the better deal. But I knew I didn't need 36 right now. I get a nice variety of colors. And when you get into mixing, the possibilities are endless. I still think if this works out, I'm going to try this first. I'm going to make probably a video making like four or five colors and just mixing them because that's what i'm really interested to do i have primary colors i have the basic popular colors i need colors like one of my big things is looking for a burnt orange i bought a burnt orange polish that i like but i need a burnt orange acrylic like i need a forest green i need a mustard yellow so you know a lot of those colors you get 
when you mix together other colors, you know. So that's why I didn't go straight with the big pack because I really want to mix them and see what that's giving. So that was really one of the main things I came to get. Second thing I did not come to get, but I got are these roll up stackable containers. I make glitter mixes all the time. I usually have to like, sometimes if I only make a little bit, I will throw it away because I just use it on that one client and it's very customized and specific to that one client. So I'll probably throw it away if I make a little. If I made this much, I would not throw it away. If I make more, I put it in a little baggie from like something else I bought from nail tip bags, from, I don't know, you just end up with stuff and don't throw stuff away. When you a nail tech, you have bags that's left over, maybe even little boxes, little containers, little jars, plastic jars, glass jars, you don't throw stuff away. You know that you can repurpose things all the time. But I'm gonna use these to make custom glitter mixes. I have two and they were 350 a piece. And they had a bigger size, uh, and smaller sizes which i might come back and get because sometimes i'll need a whole bunch of glitter i just need a little bit but i still don't want to throw it away because i could use it again i have these from amazon oh i hate this lighting but you can kind of see what it is still i have these and they are for nail piercings i got a whole stack of them in gold from amazon with the pliers with the tool but I didn't get the silver ones. And I don't think that it's going to be that popular that I need a whole kit. Like when I got the Amazon kit, I got a whole kit. Like hundreds of little piercings in different sizes. I don't think I need that many. It's not really a popular thing. People don't really ask me to do that. I got these mixes. You are not going to get this color. It's pink. All different shades of pink. Very, very pretty. I'm looking at it right now and then I'm looking at it like this and the camera is not doing it any kind of justice. It is so reflecting and so pretty. The bottom row is gorgeous. The top row is gorgeous. I love pink. I love pink aesthetic. My room is pink, my nail room. And I'm trying to just really get my nail room together so that I could do a nail room tour. But I want it to be laid out, like laid the fuck out. Like I want it to be really pretty before I do a tour of it. And the best thing that I had the most success with today at Hobby Lobby was glitter. I went in there for glitter. I specifically wanted it, but I didn't know I was going to come out with this many. And I didn't know it was going to be so many that I left behind that I loved. And I know for a fact you are not going to really get the gist of it, but I'm still going to show you. We have gold stars. Can I zoom? What is zoom giving on the video? Can videos zoom? Videos cannot zoom. That sucks. Okay. I have this lime highlighter. Yellow. It's called neon yellow. It's very much giving that highlighter color. That's really popular every single summer. But I just wanted to get it in a glitter because I've never seen that color in a glitter that true. This is a mixture of pink and gold. Oh, I hate this right now. Oh, I know what I'm about to do. I know exactly what Okay, and a new angle. Look at the pink. You can see the pink way, 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 way better. I love glitter. I will put glitter on everybody else if I could. I'll put it in every set. Don't worry about that Hello Kitty carpet. It's very dirty. Don't worry about it. So, oh, let's start over. These are the stars that I was telling you about. I would love to put these in glitter mixes. I even bought a silver one. That's going to be really pretty in glitter mix. And this one's a little bit bigger than us, the gold one. That's okay. This is the true highlighter yellow that I was talking about. Very pretty. Then we got... Oh, and all of these were 350 349 rose gold this is very much fall it's giving very fall is this copper yes this is copper penny that's so pretty i need an acrylic this color it is so pretty i'm gonna put this in an acrylic and try to do something with that this is what i was talking about with the pink and the, the gold is called unicorn mix i mostly just got it because it's called unicorn mix and it has unicorn pieces in it uh wish you could see them I'm gonna open it because I want you to see them. 
okay you could probably see now like the body of the actual unicorn they have actual unicorns in them i could see myself taking the pink and just like dotting that all over the nail encapsulating that i could see myself encapsulating the gold four point stars which i already have some of but they're really pretty these hollow stars i don't know if you can see them but there are some hollow stars there you go there's some hollow stars five point silver hollow stars and then of course i would definitely putting be putting these unicorns in somebody's nail if they want it or in mine child that's pretty that's really pretty next two is a pink i only got this pink because this dark pink i do not have and i think these are the fine these are the extra fine so these should be able to be used for sugar nails that's really how um i want to use this pink i have lighter pinks that i can use for sugar nails but not anything this deep and it was a couple more that i wanted to get but i had to have some control because i was getting too many and pumpkin this is right up the burnt orange alley that i was talking about i really want to make an acrylic or find an acrylic that is perfectly burnt orange like like this so oh some of them were a little cheaper some of them were three and some of them were 350 but i really really love all together everything that i got i'm really really happy with my purchases i don't think that this trip was a waste i didn't get everything that i wanted as many things that i did not get but i feel like hobby lobby online as always when you look at things online and then you look at things in the store it's always about you know what the what the stock is like in the store and what people have come and bought etc etc so even though it, it, they had it online i guess i couldn't just expect for them to have it in the store but i was really happy with the stuff i got i don't feel like it was overpriced i feel like 56 dollars for how much money all of this will make me is definitely worth it it's definitely worth it so i will be back at hobby lobby again and i will be going to other stores as well so that's it y'all i'll catch y'all in the next one bye